All right, next up, coming out to a flying start. Harry Berrington. Apologies if I pronounced your name wrong there, Harry, but someone who's given me this bit of paper can't write very neatly. His opponent, he's all in black with a rash guard, we've got Glenn Dring. Both guys, open clinch. Dring pushes back to the cage wall. Berrington trying to secure Green's right leg. Uh, there we see Dring's going for the reverse Kimura. You can see Harry Berrington stretching the arm out, holding his own leg. That's an excellent defence there. Excellent defence for the reverse Kimura, which is a horrible submission to have to endure. Berrington tries to take an overhook. He's given his back up, but Dring's off balance, so he should survive that without any, uh, without too much of a problem. Now he secures that half guard again. Oh, yeah, we see Dring's take a full mount, I believe. Yeah, his other leg's clear, so he's in full mount position. He's going for a, a pure face smother now. Just trying to exert pressure on the head of Barrington. Very rarely ends in a sub. Well, I said that about the scissor choke earlier, and then we've got two in a row. So what do I know? Yeah, we can see in the background Chris Can. TV celebrity, the face of the MMA league, the man in the suit, all round nice guy, bit of a pretty boy. Carson has watchful eye. Right, here we go, transition so Dream has got super guillotine. Harry Berrington is in trouble, he's got to pop that head out. Dream needs to work that guard higher as he does. If he pulls that guard position down, he can finish, but that's it. Harry Berrington manages to pop his head out, so to speak. And he's going to land a couple of body shots. Let Dring know what he thinks of that technique. Three minutes on the clock, so we're only halfway, just over halfway through this bout. Right, so, uh, one underhook each. Referee uh, urging both combatants to, to progress so they will get stood up. Remember, we've only got five minutes to pull off submission here at the league. Right, so here we see. Can't, can't see the Brazilian half guard. Yes, we are. So, Harry Berrington's got one leg free. He's in the half guard position. Couple of hammer fists to the body. There we go, pushing the elbow down into the solar plexus. Devastating body shot there, that was a big one. Now we can see him trying to uh, get into full mount position, which he does. And there we go, that's nice there from Dring, excellent. He uses uh, Harry Berenson's lack of balance there to turn him. So now we see Berenson on his back, Dring is in the guard position. Thirty seconds left. These guys are going to have to get a move on if they want to score a submission here, or it's going to be time for a draw. We're coming into the dying seconds. Another reversal. Berrington into mount position. Dring is holding on for all he is worth. 
And that's time. That one goes to a draw. Glenn is in a draw.